Hey guys, today we are going to talk about this exception. Um, cannot invoke java.net.url to external form because location is null. Now I'm going to reproduce this error. Let's start. Here I'm going to add a frame. In this frame, I'm going to add a label. This label we will use um, to set a background the way it works. We will change the icon property of the label. Um, so let's see how we can do that. Open the properties, then in the icon, there are three dots. If you click this, you end up in this window. Here, image within project. So if I click three dots again, as you can see, I have already added this folder called images. I added a picture. I'm going to select this picture. And as you can see, we have this label added with the picture. Now we can use this picture as a background. So what I'm going to do here, just clear this label text. And just for your demonstration purposes, I'm going to set this frames layout to no. And add a button so you can see. Now we got button on top and you can add as many controls you want and your picture will act as a background. To run this form i'm going to add um, another class uh, with the main method on it will be driver class so here we're going to create a main method i'm going to create an object for frame we created And I'm going to set the property of this frame, visible property true, true. Okay, now we are ready to run. And uh, let's run this and see if we can replicate the error we were looking for. So as you can see, our program uh, compiler has already thrown exception. So um, here is a error we were we are going to fix in this video. To fix this problem, we will right click onto the label, customize code. Let me expand this window. Okay, so here we have a default code for label dot set icon. Here we are using get class and get resource. For some reason, uh, this is not generating the correct path for this picture. To correct this, what I'm going to do here, set the default code to custom property, which will allow us to change this um, default code. So here, we're going to use System dot get property user directory. This will return the correct path of our project. Then I added us this sub path which will lead to the correct picture address. And then I concatenated both frame paths together. And hopefully it will fix our problem. Let's try. Let's try to run this code and see if this works. I'm going to run driver class again and no error this time. So where is form? Oh, this is on my next screen. 
okay here we have loaded a background picture into the form without any error please do like and subscribe my video thank you